I've been competing in Lombardia. It was the first competition for me. Um, I move out from juniors to seniors, so it's kind of difficult for me. I mean, I've been competing in seniors as well. But um, yeah, it just was the first competition. We are not that ready, you know. So I've made new short with my coach Florana Modio. The programs are kind of the same. It's just like there is better guys, for sure. I mean, I'm not saying the juniors they are like uh, not that good guys. There's like top at the junior worlds last year. It was like 17 guys doing triple axel, even in the short program. So it's just um, it's just different a little bit. I mean, there's like the guys which are more famous and stuff. So you need to like focus on your stuff, not to, you know on the other ones. I think it's um, because I changed the coach last year. Before the last year, I went to uh, Florana Modia. The most important for me is to come on the ice, look big, look great, perfect skating. I mean, we are not robots, like, we don't like do the jumps all the time, you know, like, sometimes you miss, it's like absolutely normal. But um, just I'm trying to like, uh, you know, like look good, skate around, like skating big stuff and you know what I mean, like just trying to push myself a little bit harder than I did before. So we're gonna focus for nationals this year. It's uh, We have like a four national championship, which is from uh, Czech Republic, Poland, Slovakia and uh, Hungary. And uh, basically I need to be, uh, I want to be like top two because we still have Michael Brezina representing Czech Republic. So I'm focusing to be uh, top two to get Europeans championship and world championship to qualify by this. So I'm um, practicing with Florian Amodia in France in uh, the mountains. Uh, it's close to Grenoble. It's, it's the village in the mountains called Vojani. There's not so much people, I mean. But um, about the coach, um, uh, he was an awesome skater when he was still competing. So, um, you know, he has something like, something special, like he's a good dancer. He can show, you know, like he can do shows on ice and stuff like this. Yeah, he's like a huge inspiration for me. So he's the one who's motivating me the most. I mean, for me, he is very cool and uh, calm, you know. Um, he knows what I should do or what I need. That's, uh, that's why I believe him. He's not that older than me. He's like uh, 28 and I'm gonna be soon 20. So, uh, I mean, we have the respect between each other, which is needed for the skating as a coach and a skater. I respect him, what he says, and I'm trying to do what he's telling me. When I was about five, six, I, when I started skating, I wanted to play hockey. So um, they told me in a club, I need to, I need to learn how to skate and uh, I went on the ice and uh, there was a guy his name is Andre Tarek he's, uh, he, was, he used to represent Italy in pair skating and uh, following the years uh, he, was, he started working as a coach in the club where I started skating so uh, I decided to try figure skating and uh, basically he was the first coach which uh, like teach me single axle so it was like a huge step for me and uh, we are still friends I mean it's a pretty cool guy but like this is the like the number one memory what I have thank you so much for this interview thank you so nice much here I wish you all the best for the rest of the season thank you <laughs>